Okay, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to share songs. Now, songs are easily shared uh, through a, an encoding scheme that we have set up, and that encoding scheme is done through email. So, what you'll want to do is, after you've made your changes to the song, and click on Song Details, and scroll down to Email Song. We'll tap on that, and you'll get this email already pre-filled out and what we have of interest down here at the bottom is it looks like a bunch of uh, garbage characters this is actually the song and the notes the chords they're all encoded this is what we need if we want to bring this in into Trumpet Pro so I can send this to someone else I can send it to myself or I can set it up I can copy paste this so it'll go into say a website Okay, so other people can copy paste this. So what I have here is codes. Now how do I copy paste this? Well I happen to have an email up and the iPhone, iPod Touch, and the iPad all have the ability to select uh, a set of text and what you do is you just keep the finger pressed down and then you release and you'll see the select option. And then I'm going to scroll up and it's going to select some text, but I have to make sure that I have everything selected. Notice I have an equal sign here in the lower left corner that didn't get selected. I'll need to drag this little blue dot and pull it down so it's it's selected. So everything is selected. Once I have everything selected, then I can tap on the copy option above. Now what this is going to do is it's going to put it into what's called the paste board. Once I have this in the paste board by tapping copy, we're golden. We're good, okay? If I'm in my email application or if I'm in running Safari or whatever, I've already did my copy. So I'm set and I can get out of my email right now. If we were running my the email program, I would exit, which I'll do. We get back to Trumpet Pro. Once we're in Trumpet Pro, what you want to do is you want to browse to the song that you want to replace. It's just going to actually replace whatever song you have in our song library we have my songs set up so you may want to go to my songs and select up one of the uh, empty, empty templates so we'll go to song details now we remember we still have it in the pasteboard so all I have to do now is go to import song from email tap in import song and it's done now if I didn't highlight every single character I'd get an error message in fact, I can show you really quickly what it would happen. And select. Okay. We'll do a copy. Cancel out of here. Go to import song from email. Import song. There we go. I get an error message. The pasteboard is not valid. We did not get every single letter of that code. So you need to make sure that you've highlighted everything, but that's all there is to it. Now you have to do this one song at a time. There's no way to, to mass import a bunch of songs. But if you have several songs, it really is just uh, highlight, copy, and then import. Highlight, copy, import, back and forth. So that's all you need to do, and thank you very much for being a customer.